always fill us with beautiful songs. Of course. <laughs> Two decades after posing beautifully in front of the camera, as beautiful as I am, adorned in the regal rich Ghanaian kente, holding a pot and a calabash with a flashing smile. I least expected my image to go viral and become a celebrated national figure. I came across one painting one hot afternoon at a drinking bar. There was a woman in beads, holding a calabash in a pot, pouring out palm wine. I looked up to this picture and said, I will grow up to be like you one day. Its beauty inspired me. And so, I only wanted a picture replica of it to hang in my room just to welcome my loved ones home. Nansum penin fubu baby say, will be ni mo brempong na chasse. And so this picture was taken in the year 1999, when I was just 18. And it had an inscription at the top, Akwaba, which means welcome in Ghana. After a few months, I realized this image of mine started going viral. It had been used on several collectibles. It had grazed the walls of several homes, several hotels, several hospitals, schools, airports, arts and craft centers, and even in the homes and offices of prominent people, including presidents. Now I realized that my ionic image had become a national asset. It had become a symbolism and the true representation of Ghana's hospitality, making me the face that welcomes all people outside the country into our motherland, Ghana. How beautiful. But then, I don't even know the commercial value of what is being made out of my picture. A picture I paid for. This picture could have made me an international model, couldn't it? It could have made me a royal. But then here I am, with no recognition at all. Not even a local champion. I broke records. I broke records in the Ghanaian modeling industry. This achievement was so legendary that even models in Ghana, yet unborn, would have to struggle to match with the records that I have set. My image is so widespread and circulated by virtue of, of how it has been used in several collectibles and of how it still features on many platforms. But then who has ever wondered who this lady in question is? Who has made an attempt to identify this woman here? Who has asked where she's from or what her name is? Here I am, Ghana's Mona Lisa, and I am proud. Here I am, that heroine whose face welcomes all people outside the country into Mother Ghana. My name is Angelina Nana Ekia Odro, Ghana's heroine, the one whose face is behind this Aquaba portrait. Thank you.